Hi guys and welcome to another uh, quick tip Photoshop video. This video I wanted to show you how I created uh, this uh, collage using an existing feature in Photoshop. It actually came about from this video, um, how to easily create a contact sheet and a, a YouTube user asked me would it be possible to use this not to make a contact sheet but to make a collage of multiple images that can be rotated, superimposed um, on each other etc. So I'm going to show you how I created this uh, collage and you can easily move them about as well on top of each other. Um, uh, it's very quick and easy. So first, um, first you've got to decide how many uh, images you're going to have and place it into a folder on your computer. Then you go to File, Automate and you click on Contact Sheet 2. Now choose the folder so this is the folder I've got I've got four images in there click open um, I don't have any subfolders in there so I'm just going to untick subfolder the document size uh, I've chosen here uh, the uh, A4 landscape size you can choose any size you want or do any size you want add any size in there a resolution um, you can do 300 or 72 depends on what you want to do with the collage make sure this here is unchecked um, this here uh, once you run it, it'll it'll flatten the image and won't give you the actual layers uh, to work on, individual layers to work on. I will show you how this one, uh, this will affect it uh, later after I run this first uh, example. Then here are the thumbnails. Uh, because I've got four images, I've decided to go with two columns and two rows. This actually will determine the size of the images it places on your document. I will show you again that example after I run this first example. So once I've chosen all that I'm going to click OK. It's going to create the document first and then it's going to add the images on top. So here it is now. Uh, I can now see the layers panel all the in separate layers. I can just move them around and that's it. That's how simple it is to create uh, a collage a photo collage using an existing uh, feature such as the uh, contact sheet feature. Now let me run this example again by showing you those uh, other features I was talking to you about. So I'm going to go into file automate contact sheet. Now if I choose to flatten all layers and let's say I choose to go with uh, three columns and two rows. Now like I said this will determine the size of the images it will place in the document. Click OK. And there we go. See, because I chose to flatten the layers, I have no layers to work with. It's just one big image. See, it's all just one image now. And three columns, two, uh, two rows. It determines the size because it's got to finish. It's got to fit the images in those three columns. So it, it, um, you know, it determines the size of the image. It, um, uh, it, it made it smaller to fit those three columns. So again, you know, decide how many photos and then you can set uh, the settings according to that uh, over here, in, in here. That's it guys. Uh, I hope you uh, got something out of that. I hope it helped you out. Uh, please don't hesitate to comment below with any suggestions or feedback. I'm always happy to hear from you. I'm, I'm happy to check out your websites and videos. So please include all your links. Uh, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe um, uh, for regular videos like this in the future. And if you like this video, hit that like button. It'll certainly help us out. And again, thanks for watching, guys.